Want to connect your GoDaddy domain to Google Workspace and look professional with the custom email addresses? In this step-by-step -step tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how we can actually do this process in a very easy way. There are a few prerequisites in order to continue. So, the first prerequisite is to have a GoDaddy domain. To purchase a domain, go into GoDaddy.com, type the a domain that would you like to purchase, and go for search domain. Once you have selected a domain would you like to purchase, go for uh, purchase now and once you have actually made the process of the very first uh, sale here let's go directly here into your account my products inside my product what you want to do is to have access to the dns setting of the domain that you have purchased in my case here's my domain and i look out for this option that says dns so the next prerequisite is to have a google workspace subscription so you have the link to down below in the description to get started totally for free with this Google Workspace and you can create your own contact information and here basically it's going to be asking you to set up your account by adding a domain you already own. By this we're going to be using the GoDaddy. So copy the domain that you can purchase with GoDaddy and paste it right in here. Then hit into next. You are not a robot of course. Hit into next and go for next. So this is how it should be appearing your domain. So let's go for next. And here you can start by creating an actual username. For example, here's the name, the passcode, and I am not a robot. Now it's gonna be asking you to try this out by yourself, just by signing in really quickly. And then the last part is just to pay for the trial version. And of course, to verify your account. Then here into the verify your own uh, domain, I'm going to be choosing the option of GoDaddy. Then go for continue. Once you have actually done this process, it's going to be asking you to enter this information. If you are using GoDaddy, usually it's going to be, of course, telling you that this process has now been successfully done automatically. Just go for sign in, grant the access, and you're good to go. But if this won't let you continue, you don't have to worry, we can do this manually. So basically what you need to do is to just add this information, for example, the TXT record. Back in GoDaddy, let's go for add new record. The type, once again, it was a TXT, the name, uh, the host by default, the data, I'm gonna be pasting right here and go for continue and do exactly the same thing with the C name record. Copy this info and paste it right in here. Then let's go for confirm once you have updated the code and go for confirm once again. My domain is gonna be ready right away. So let's go for activate the Gmail, go for continue, and here is my user. Now I need to add once again this MX record. Go for explore Google Workspace. So verify the domain ownership, verify that everything works correctly. Test the email functionality. So go to the Gmail, send some email tests to your new custom email address, check if it's received and ensure you can reply from the same address. If everything works, congratulations because you have successfully connected your domain directly here into Google Workspace. So I'm gonna head back directly into another Gmail account to make sure that I have received a new mail with my uh, Google Workspace elements. I'm gonna hit now into all the mail to see if this one is appearing here. As you can see, here it is. And test mail, it actually works. So as you can see, this is how we can actually do this process really easily from GoDaddy directly here into Google Workspace. So that's it. Now you have all set to use the Google Workspace with Google account. So custom emails that not only look professional, but it also helps build trust with the customers. If you find this got helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully it was very useful for you and see you next time.